Camerons, brewed by a connoisseur, not an accountant. Hi, I'm Vanessa Markov, and we're hanging out with Julian Taylor at the Mediazoic Studio in downtown Toronto. How are you doing? I'm really good. How are you, Vanessa? Good, thanks. Awesome. Thank you for coming to join us today. Thank you for having me on such short notice. Awesome. Yeah. Oh, very happy to have you in. That was a great session that we just did. Oh, thank you. Um, first, I guess we'll we'll start off with, um, I mean, you've been around for a while in the industry. You've done quite a few things, uh, different projects. Why don't you tell us a little bit about um, some of the projects that are closest to your heart? The closest to my heart? Um... Yeah, I've been around for a while. I'm 34 years old. I've been doing this since I was 14, so I've been around for 20 years. And uh, I can't really pinpoint things that uh, are the nearest and dearest to my heart. I know that playing with my band, uh, Stagger Crossing, was certainly a, a pinnacle and a highlight for me when uh, we were doing what we were doing. Put out four records, had a few top ten hits, mm -hmm. signed to Warner Music Canada, had, some, uh, had a good run, and it was a, a lot of fun. And uh, after that, I started Bent Penny Records. Well, sort of in the same time. Everything sort of meshes together mm -hmm. uh, for me. Uh, and uh, had a good time with Bent Penny Records, too. Uh, hung out with acts like Hello Beautiful and signed those guys uh, to their first licensing deal. And uh, Julie Crochetche and Susie McNeil all helped those people get on radio, awesome. as well as my old band, Stagger Crossing. And then uh, I got tired. And I stopped playing music, and I stopped uh, working in the music business. And I put down my guitar for a couple of years, and I put down the phone for a couple of years, and worked as a bartender, and just got back to who I was, and, and then finally um, sold Bent Penny and came back and decided to play again. What made you decide to come back to music? I love music. <laughs> it's who I am. And uh, sometimes you need to put things down to find out that. Right. Right. Yeah. You, you mentioned earlier we were talking that you started a charity. I didn't start a charity. No, I uh, I, I support and and, uh, and, and advocate for a, a particular charity that uh, helps send children that have cancer to camp overnight. And it, the, the camp is called Camp Ooch. Um, camp and, Ooch. Yeah, CampOooch.org. And uh, every summer I've been going up and... Uh, writing songs with the kids up there and doing song uh, workshops. It's, it's a really amazing thing to be able to do. And uh, in fact, I played a song called Be With You Tonight that was, that was written up there. Great. Well, actually, speaking of Be With You, uh, why don't we take a break right now and we'll listen to that song sounds, live from Mediazoic. Sounds good. 